Chief Government Negotiator with the MILF, Miriam Coronel Ferrer, sees the passage of the proposed Bangsamoro Basic Law within the year. The full story from Freddy Abando. The House is still in waiting for the submission of the proposed Bangsamoro Basic Bill, which will implement the comprehensive Bangsamoro Agreement signed between the government and the MILF in March. The Transition Commission submitted the proposed measure to Malacanang in April. It's still under review by the President's legal team to ensure it will overcome any constitutional challenge. It was supposed to be submitted in May, and because of the delay, the review will come when Congress resumes in late July after the President delivers his State of the Nation. It is currently under review. It is currently under review and it partakes of a national law. Speaker Fellow Channel Belmonte and Senate President Franklin Drillon expressed their commitment to the President to approve the measure by the end of the year. But minority members of the House are concerned this may not be possible if the submission of the measure is delayed. I think there are certain issues which ought to be threshed out further and uh, the MLF, MILF was not able to get it, I think. Mm -hmm. The right to self-determination of the Moro people should most definitely be recognized. The origin scene is here, They themselves call it what you call um, last two minutes. We already have, what? We have the uh, Bank Samoa. It's very important. We want the peace process. You know, to prosper. A contentious issue raised by several congressmen from Mindanao is the agreement on fishing in the proposed banks of Moro waters. Government Chief Negotiator Professor Miriam Coronel Ferrer assured that the waters are still available to all Filipino citizens for fishing, subject to regulation by the banks of Moro government and local governments with respect to their municipal waters. Although preferential treatment is given, the Bangsamoro people, the indigenous groups, and residents in areas covered by the agreement. Ang mangyayari po dito, this will be under the jurisdiction of the national government, but arrangements can be made, especially with, on how to further enhance the economic development of these regions, as we said, considering these are also the poorest provinces. So, hindi po contradiction yung aming sinabi kanina na yung wala po talagang uh, ang, 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 ang zones of cooperation po ay hindi nasa ilalim ng Bangsamoro government. Meron lang pong mga me mechanisms where that kind of cooperation can, can exist. And that is not unique to this place. For the People's Television Network, this is Freddie Abanda reporting.